Hey, it's me, Marquis Joe, here to entertain you. Yes, it is my show. It exists. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Marky Joe 1990 here, and for once, I'm up early. So, this, I'm just gonna read out the whole title for you, alright? So, it's Rana and Rana and Rana proudly presents Supersonic Emblem, Rage Fest, and Knuckles. Uh, uh, I don't know where the. At the Impl Olympic Games Bros featuring Dante from the Devil May Cry series. So, odds are, if you're looking at the video title, I might have chosen an alternative name for this submission. Um, and before we start, I also want to show you guys, like, so in the readme, <laughs> in the readme it says this, alright? Uh, like near the very top. Hey dude, if you are reading this, it probably means you are either Mark or someone else. Don't crack my shit. Anyways, here are some extra explanations, alright? And it just goes on a bit, wait, what the? Traps aren't gay? Oh my god. Okay. So we already had a submission that had like a million fucking memes in it. I'm generally not a fan of memes, so I don't know how I feel about this, especially the fucking I'm so sick of traps aren't gay. I'm gonna race in, in the next race in response to Lair the Fucker video. She's gonna end that fucking argument once and for all. I promise you guys. Promise! I made this video before finishing the Raisin Answers Your Questions Again video. Unfortunately, I removed the Are Traps Gay question because there were too many joke questions and not enough serious ones. But basically, Raisin's response was, not unless they are. Anyway, let's get this show on the road, shall we? New game, Rage Fest, easy modo. Oh, that's a Toho meme. Oh shit, what the fuck is this guy? He's like Ford, but with a chin. And I helped Rana with his scripts. Did you know you could speed up the game by holding the... Uh, oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, I just pressed the A button. Look at the cursor. Like, it's, it's dangling just a tiny bit more this time. So it's a bit more exciting. Hold on, let me just check my uh, recording device settings. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. All right, we're good. <laughs> Okay, so anyway, in Gay Boy Mo okay, whatever. You can also temporarily skip the animation, hitting the next unit button, so I guess that's, okay, so that's a D button, good to know. Okay, Game Boy Mode, yada, yada, yada. Gotta make sure the thing is still connected, okay. Me and Rana hope you will have fun with playing. Yay! Oh shit, it's Dat Boy Matthew, what the fuck? Deliver the ring to Mark? Oh, wow. This is probably going to be a little contradictory to tactical nonsense. Which one will be declared canon? Nobody knows. Also, wow, I noticed that there's actually, like, custom tile set shit in this. That's really neat. Like, they had the uh, flowers going on. That happened in, um, Tale of Pert 2 as well, but I, I didn't really, like, make note of it. The, the, it had the Alice shattered glass or whatever thing. Wow, that was easy. <laughs> Oh, wow. So they, like, just spilt cola on him, huh? Oh, they pushed him into a dumpster. Okay. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. So he's gonna get... Oh, there's beds. That's pretty neat. What the... <laughs> okay, so... For the uninitiated, the guy all the way to the right is literally like a webcam version of myself, but with like my my portrait art's hair just fucking photoshopped on top. The guy to the left of him is my brother Evil Ego Waffle, who shows up in several of my commentaries. And he's just holding a spicy grilled chicken sandwich. And I don't know what the fuck is going on on the left. I guess that's the video game I'm playing. It's actually, <laughs> we even thought this was a good idea to put this game on. God, everything sucks in 3D nowadays. Yeah, that that's right. 2D waifus for the best. Ah, fuck it. Get a, get a real girlfriend, guys. Don't be like me, who's still clinging on to racing for, for like over seven years. You've only been playing it for five minutes. I almost want to like do this in his voice. We really need to get out of here. Right. Oh, he's a knight? I feel like he'd be, be better as, like, a hero or something. Heh. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Okay, so 
I made another video uh, called Marky Joe Takes the Trash Out. I have a feeling that the trash all the way to the left is a reference to that. We've got trouble. Uh-oh, is, uh, is Felicia going to show up now because he said we got trouble? Ender Slicer? Can I keep him? Aw. He could stay, I guess. Well, that's good. <laughs> Dad Boy Matthew finally has a friend. And that's Imperial, I think. Uh, Imperial is a member of the Lair the Fucker community, which is my community. And yes, confirmed right there. Yeah. Imperial always makes jokes about how he, how everybody's a fucking weeaboo g degenerate in the chat, so... This is in character for him. He would definitely, like, if he was a ruler of some country, he would definitely be doing some fucking Final Solution level shit with weebs. <laughs> and I called him Walt. Man, why is that boy Matthew so fucking popular? Like, here's the thing, alright? This was before Tactical Nonsense. Like, everybody made their submissions. They didn't know Tactical Nonsense was gonna be a thing. I think. But Dad Boy Matthew was, at least before Tactical Nonsense, a relatively unassuming member of the chat. Like, he was just kind of there. He was goofy. He was definitely a silly guy. But he, like... <laughs> I probably sound really offensive here, but he didn't really... He, he kind of, like, blended in, I guess? Oh, is that high there? All right. Oh, so I guess they're like ogres or something. Oh shit, guys, hold on. All right. So what's gonna happen? Tune out. Tune in next time for Marky Joe 1990. Marky Joe. No, I'm just kidding. Let's just continue. <laughs> ah, no bully. What the fuck? You might have noticed that I'm really energetic in this episode, and that is because I'm awake. I'm not like doing a commentary at like two in the fucking morning for once. All right, let's see what we get. Whoa, this is a compl- What? All right, so that's Noah's face put on Gonzalez's body. All right, so immediately sympathizing with them, I guess. Unarmed. Well, there we go. That is true. If that's good or bad is up to you. Yeah, I mean, it is subjective. Yes! Spicy grilled chicken sandwich, yeah. It is definitely a reference to my spicy grilled chicken sandwich video. Go look that up for context. Yeah, I got it from Subway. I don't know about quality. All right, cool. What do I got here? So I don't have any weapons, I just realized, unless this is my weapon? No, it's not, because if it was, then this would have been here. Also, something... Something about... I don't know how to explain it, but the game feels more responsive than usual. Alright, there's a- Hey! And that's a picture of me hugging the garbage can in the Mark Joe Takes the Garbage Out video. Damn, Rana, you are what you are quite the Marky Joe fan. I would have never fucking guessed with how often you're like, Mark, you're doing this wrong. Fucking fix it. Wow, Walt just has to do the whole thing <laughs> with with garbage on his fucking head. Oh, uh, He's such he's such a uh, a kicking boy, a whipping boy rather. More handsome, bigger brother. What the fuck? Fuck you. Wait, does a lot of dick jokes. Yes, that is true. Wait, his mini portrait is just like. <laughs> oh wait, I just realized it's evil ego waffle, which is what he changed his name to for a while, and then I was like, no, stop. <laughs> and then Imperial. Anime is a mistake, and so are you. Wait, Toxic Lance? Spreads toxicity? Rana, are you trying to say something about Imperial? I mean, come on! Alright, Villager. Pissed off at the bandits, a force to be reckoned with. Alright, fair enough. Mage is on fire. Okay, so that the classes all have different things. 
What would happen if they fall in their back? Probably not anything good. So, adeptness. All right, so they pretty much have basic skills. Are you, oh my god. You again? Really? All right. Yep, favorite idol. So, if you guys don't know who Eveser is, just look on the first part of Tale of Pert 2 Meme Lords Across Time. Yay! So, I'm guessing he'll join our side or something, because... I don't know, he just seems kind of useless, and that speed feels like it, it, it would have, like, a fucking purpose, you know? Instead of having sex, wow. Yeah, they, I mean, yeah, that is true. Mercenaries are basically whores for killing people. I would not deny that in an instant. <laughs> ah! Fighting for the hood. They are essentially mafia. All right. What happened if I, oh, it's just the same as before. Children of the Holy War, probably gay. And Pegasus Riders. Butt Stallion Ultra Digitation? Oh boy, people are gonna, there are gonna be people in the comments like, oh my God, is that a reference to my favorite thing? Oh my God, I love this hack. Second place. Mysen's twin brother, huh? Seems to be very evil. Oh, wait, there's this guy, too. Len. He fights for his friends. All right, fair enough. Does uh, does this have a different description? Nope. It's just typical. All right, so I think we're just about ready. So I think our first thing is we're going to have to... Uh, this motherfucker. Oh, I should probably speed things up. Keep the animations on just in case he fucked with anything. And make... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. I saw that, Rana. This color kind of sucks. Please don't take this. Less worse than three and four. Wow. You know what? This one is kind of interesting. Look. Oh. Yeah, perfect. It's the right amount of suck. Fuck up by getting Axel killed, Mark killed. Good luck, fucko. Wait, Sirem is a fucking Mulder wannabe? God damn it, I'm fighting all sorts of shit now. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, focus, Mark. Let's go. Damn it. Ah, oh, Dead Boy Matthew. Help me. Save me. Damn it, these fucking enemies are strong. I can already tell because I can't double him, and that makes him strong. All right, do I have any way to heal him after this? Because, like, this bitch is going to nail my ass to a cross. Yeah, he takes a shitload of damage. Oh, boy. It's another enemy phase based submission, huh? Okay, so wait, wait, wait. I can attack with him, and then Dad Boy Matthew will be safe. Yeah, look at that shit. Damn, this music's pretty epic, though, I gotta say. What? What EXP? What the fuck is that gay ass shit? He's level 5! This guy's higher level than him! And yet he gains 1 EXP? Damn it, Rana! You're a fucking... It's like if you are you were a Jew, but with EXP. Damn it, I just realized I can't... I still have to kill him in, in multiple hits with, with that boy. How the fuck am I supposed to deal with this shit? I should probably stop complaining and actually get things done. You know, instead of being a fucking baby. All right, well, let's see how this works out. I'm sure that I'm going to die on the first turn because that's typically how these FEXP submissions, you know, work. Not gonna lie. Oh, here it comes. Here comes the death. Oh! Imperial proven that he can dodge by slightly tilting his body at roughly 30 degrees, I'd say. I, th that seems like an accurate estimate. So, I guess a small comment I'm gonna point out. Um, yeah, that's that sound effect, the sound effect of like the enemies getting hit and shit, it's not as satisfying as in the G GBA games. Like, it... it it just sounds kind of like you're... You, it it kind of sounds like you're smacking spaghetti with your hand. That's just kind of what it sounds like. But, but like, in, in the GBA Fire Emblems, if something gets hit, it kind of it makes it sound like you're cracking a fucking nut. Mm! It's fucking great. So, so what, that, that, that is my criticism for today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, 5 out of 10, not enough crunchy pain. All right, this is gonna be a problem. Oh, great, and the Pegasus Rider is also moving. 
Oh, I might need some of that spicy grilled chicken sandwich then. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, so it's one of those submissions where we have to watch a million things at once. That's fine. I can deal with it for now. At least for now. Not forever, mind you, but you know, for now at least we're gonna watch this shirtless motherfucker just do his thing. Also, I'm digging the, uh, like, the tile set that's, like, near the village is kind of interesting. I don't know what it's supposed to be, but it's, it's different. I guess it's, like, cement road or some shit? I don't fucking know. Anyway, that guy just pounded another guy to oblivion. Uh, and yeah, now it is my turn. Hooray! Okay, so. Something tells me I've already done the wrong thing. Well, all right. Ender Slicer? I mean, because th that's what he is. It's Ender Slicer. Wait a minute. Hold on a sec. What is that background for the portraits? <laughs> I love people like Waffle's face. He's just so happy. Did anybody get a thing? I forget. No. Oh, that's... Okay, so I got I to gotta snag it from him first. Damn it. All right. Well, it's gambling time, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah! Evil Egg Waffle! Oh, look! He did, look at Evil Egg Waffle's face! He's like pointing at his eye like, Yes! As you can see, this guy was stabbed. Uh, indeed! Alright, why the fuck did I go into this battle not prepared for battle? I don't get that shit whatsoever. Uh, okay, so there's another Pegasus Rider, but it's okay. We're not gonna die right away. So, Dad Boy Matthew, it's time for you to do your lovely thing. Yeah! That boy Matthew, man. <laughs> he just has a quality to him, I guess. That's probably why he's he's being in so many submissions now. Cause he's been in, I think, three so far. Like counting his own and shit. So I don't know, he just has a quality to him. Maybe it is his unassumingness that makes him stand out so much, you know? Wow, holy shit. Okay, so I assume you're one of those units that I gotta train up. Ender Slicer. Okay, here we go. Uh, you know what? Just... Whoa! What, eh. Yeah, we'll place you out of his range, because if he attacks you, then you're going to do jack shit damage. And I kind of want to get a head start on these enemies on the next turn. Oh, snap. He's got fire. That's not good. I mean, I have fire too, but my fire is the good fire. So, ha. So, so far, you know what? I'm actually pleasantly surprised. Uh, not necessarily at the gameplay, because, I mean, the fucking NPC shit. I mean, I like that the enemies are coming after me. Like, so far, it seems challenging so far. But when I say I'm, like, pleasantly surprised, what I mean is that, like, my commentary hasn't get gotten cock-blocked yet by, like, a million fucking cutscenes or by the game being, like, way too hard right away. Because uh, that's, that's what happens in, like, a lot of these submissions is that, like, Suddenly I have to focus on the dialogue or I have to focus on like playing well and that ends up killing my commentary momentum So I just end up like I I just stop talking or I stop saying witty shit I think I've been keeping it up pretty well this time around though All right now that said uh, What the fuck else am I supposed to say at this point? I don't know. Uh, well, okay, so more Pegasus Riders Pegasus Riders, I mean that boy Matthew I'm glad that you're the one who's killing these Pegasus Riders because the, your Pegasus Riders were my worst fucking nightmare in your submission. Shit, man. Aw, oh, Bandit, you didn't fucking dodge. Now you got impaled by a girl who's like... You know what? Something that's always been weird to me is the way that the Pegasus Riders sit on the Pegasus. Um, like... Like... Next time we see them, like, they're just, like, really slanted forward and, like, their legs are spread out. I don't know. It just looks odd to me. I'm sure it's the proper way to sit, and I'm sure they look comf They are comfortable where they're sitting, but I don't know. It just looks odd to me. Maybe it's just the fact that I have a dick, and if I were to lay in that position, that my, my, I would not be comfortable in the slightest, but, um, I don't know. That, I don't know. Yeah, look at that shit. Look at where the legs are. Look at the way their body's angled. It's just like, wow. She, it's almost like she's laying on a bed or some shit. Okay, so this game has safe states. I'm going to use them because this looks like it's going to be a very long chapter. 
I don't have a problem with long chapters, though I do prefer it when they are not long. Uh, I kind of prefer a concise challenge over a long one. Um, I mean, I've always been complaining like, yeah, uh, some of these mets are way too fucking long. Um, it'll probably be the case here, but I don't want to be too... Like, I don't think that's... I don't want to dismiss the entire submission over that. Let me be clear, you know? Uh, this is going to be tough. It's going to be fucking tough. Actually, wait. Why don't I just retreat? That seems like a good idea now that I think about it. Objectively. Whoa, look at my... Oh, look at me. I'm getting all... Ah! Uh. <laughs> I fucking love all my facial expressions here. Like, he really, like, went out of his way to, like... <laughs> have a different portrait for each frame of my attack just like ah mm. Mm. Yeah. Right, speaking of which uh how am i gonna get myself out of this scrape yeah because that boy matthew he's gonna get his fucking ass plowed right now if i don't do nothing about it all right but wait there is hope and when there's hope there's fire! Oh, okay. Mark, you complain about people making references to shit and then you make a reference yourself. You're a fucking, you're a fucking useless piece of shit cunt fag and hypocrite and nothing you say now is, uh, is allowed to be credible. Nothing you say is credible because you did a thing that was hypocritical. <laughs> the joke came out. There you go. That, that's my stance. All right, come on. You know what? I should probably turn off the animations, but I kind of want to see other people's facial expressions. Up. Oh, all right, bye-bye, bandit. Unless you dodge. Nope. You have not dodged. Instead, you have done the opposite. You have stood in place. Willingly, might I add. I mean, you could have easily just been like, no! But you didn't. And therefore, you're a fag. Not, not like, you're not gay. It's just you're a fag. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, I think I'm gonna turn off the animation so that this, because I'm definitely getting to that point where I'm like, all right, yep, it's a thing. Whoa. I love how me hugging the the trash can gives him strength. By the way, like when he attacked, he was totally like there was me right there just hugging it. <laughs> like I think it was twenty year old me. In fact, man, guys, I I, I gotta tell you something, right? I, I've definitely grown up a lot slower than most people have. Like, I, I was like 19 years old and I still didn't really know how to like socialize or talk to people. I was just like, I was just, I was, uh, I was joyous, but awkward, I guess. Oh, for fuck's sake, Imperial. God damn it. Um, but yeah, I mean... I can get into TMI ter territory with this, but basically I didn't learn how to do certain things until I was 19. Like, certain things, and you're dead. Well, that summarizes Imperial. <laughs> oh wait, he j Whoa? So it just keeps going even if he's dead, huh? All right, well, you know what? I'm gonna take this opportunity to just scout ahead. But yeah, you know what? I'm not going to go any deeper than that when it comes to, like, I, maybe, maybe the problem isn't that I, it, I didn't, maybe the problem isn't growing up, but so much as I was, just, I'm just a very sheltered person. I don't, I don't get out much. I'm mostly in my house all the fucking time, just, like, creating music or watching videos or, like, most of my time is spent creating stuff and looking at stuff. I don't even really play video games anymore. I'm just like, ah, oh, whatever. Why, why play a video game when I can make one? You know? By some, so, some could argue that the way I live is actually ideal. But, you know, it, it's, you got to deal with certain th aspects, you know? Because if you don't get out much, then obviously you're not going to get out much. Uh, who is this? Uh, it's Henning. But his, his, something seems off about him. Like, for example, the fact that whenever he blinks... One of his eyes doesn't close, and also a small pixel of his sideburns just gives up every time. Well, if that ain't a clue. Alright, that tells me nothing about his character, it's just another meme reference. 
Uh, all right, well, here's what I'm gonna do. I am going to run away! No! All right, but holy shit, I am getting overwhelmed like balls right over here. All right, how well do I fare against these guys? Not too well. So I'm just gonna, God damn garbage. You're fucking garbage. All right, come on. I, I gotta, I gotta figure this shit out. Oh, I also gotta turn off the animations because <laughs> my fucking face right there, man, just like, mmm. All right, you know what? This is what I'll do. Um. Oh wait, you know what? Uh, what, what was it? Solo. All right, so we'll have my animations on, but the enemy animations will be off. I think. I don't know. I think that's a good compromise. Why doesn't Walt react when he shoots somebody? He's just he just keeps his same stoic face, which arguably might be in character for him, considering how he tends to be just like the most unassuming personality. All right, hold on, hold on. I can make this shit work. Look at that, look at that garbage. Why did, hold on. Why are his defenses so bad? He's a fucking garbage pail. All right, hold on, garbage. Eat the spicy grilled chicken sandwich. Yeah. Mmm. Delicioso. All right, so I'm gonna lose some by this turn. Okay, so good. That that turned off the animation. So now this will go by faster. My animations will still go. Yeah, see? But at least that's better than nothing. Are you gonna double? Okay, good, you didn't. So that makes me happy. At least it's not like tactical nonsense where like, if you get hit by anything, chances are you're, you fuck something up. Okay, here we go. Uh, and that's KO. All right, goodbye, Walt. No. No! Dat Boy Matthew, more like Dead Boy Matthew! Wow, that's a cheesy joke. Alright, well, you know what? We're gonna. <laughs> fucking fa I don't know what it is, but seeing realistic faces in Fire Emblem just cracks me up for some. <laughs> His face when he got hit! I don't know what it is, but seeing realistic faces in Fire Emblem just cracks me up for some reason. I mean, this guy's face is funny as well. There's something off about him. He just looks fucking derpy, but... I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so we, we're we pretty much fucking cornered now. Uh, at least those guys are dead. Yay! And that frees me up a tiny bit more. All right, we're gonna check this village and then I'm probably gonna end the video. All right, cool. I, he looks, little boy? I don't know, he looks like he's in his 20s. He looks like he's working for the fucking soccer team, you know, he's one of those jocks. Alright, well, oh, the cheap gem. Uh, a reference to the Tale of Pert, I think. This one, I think, is actually made of gem. Alright, fair enough. Uh, yeah, so I think I'm in a pretty bad spot, so... I think I'm gonna end the video here, and we'll see how far I get next time. These ambush bombs just don't do it for me!